by a show where you send me stuff that you found on the internet and I try to recreate it. The suggestion for today's episode was sent in by both Hayley G and Cam Inumuzu, who want me to try out this black cage suspender skirt, which is sold out. And this type of skirt seems to be sold out pretty much everywhere that I look for it on the internet. So let's get started. The two things that I needed before beginning were a black circle skirt, which I thrifted, but you can also make yourself one using my tutorial and two meters of black elastic, although this almost wasn't enough, so I'd recommend getting at least three. With the skirt on, I draped the elastic over one shoulder, measured roughly where it should sit, and then cut this length. And I cut two pieces of elastic to this length. Then using white chalk, I marked on my skirt roughly where the two suspender straps should sit, on both the front and the back. I then took the skirt off and realized how dodgy my chalk marks were. So I neatened them up and I made them symmetrical using a tape measure to help me out. Then I pinned the pieces of elastic onto the inside of the waistband where I had made the chalk markings. And then I made sure they were both the same length to make sure I'd pin them on evenly. They were, so now I'm ready to sew them on. I sewed the straps on using black thread and a straight stitch like this to give the attachment extra support. Then with the last bit of elastic, I wrapped it around my waist where I wanted it to sit and marked with chalk where it will be attached to the suspenders. Again, I took the skirt off to make the markings more precise. I made a marking so that the elastic would be attached one inch up from the waistband all the way around. With the elastic for my waist, I first sewed it into a loop. I did a close together zigzag stitch to make sure that the elastic would hold together under stress. I hid the spot where I sewed the loop together underneath one of the suspenders. Then I pinned the whole loop on where my chalk markings were making sure that the loop was even on both sides while I pinned it. And I sewed this elastic to the suspenders at each four points, just like this. today. Episode number 13 is sitting right here on my desktop, but there's a catch. I'm not uploading it until this video gets 1,000 likes. So what do you have to do? Click that like button down below, and once this video hits 1,000 likes, I'll upload episode 13. Share my video around so it might get more likes, and if I don't get 1,000 likes, it'll be awkward, I guess. And don't forget to keep those awesome suggestions for new challenges coming. Bye!